People always ask me what my life at, is like at work, and honestly, I don't have a typical day. The best way to describe my job is to equate it to being the team mom. Granted, there are 27 guys on my, on my team, and I've had the same group of guys for the last three years, so it really is like having 27 brothers around every day. Most of us are from the Midwest, so we have a lot of the Midwestern sarcasm as well, which makes me laugh a lot. I handle all the media obligations for my driver and the 17 team, as well as coordinate with the sponsors what they want in regards to paint schemes, uniforms, signage, appearances, etc. And I help coordinate clothing, PR, special events, and anything that my guys might have going on each and every week. This past February, my team won the Daytona 500, and I truly feel like I've come full circle in my racing career. I started my NASCAR career at Daytona, and now I can say that I've been to Victory Lane in the biggest race that our sport has. It was truly an amazing moment, which I will never forget. And I think one of my fondest memories from that win is the fact that after you win the Daytona 500, you go on a week-long cross-country media blitz. I didn't sleep the night from the, the morning of the race until all of our obligations were done that first day, and I'm pretty certain that I was up for 30 plus hours. But somewhere between our flight from Dallas, Texas to Hollywood, California, I remember being on the plane and just laughing along with those folks because we were so exhausted. But it's a trip that I'll never forget. I've gotten to travel around the country and have been fortunate enough to have some pretty cool stories to tell my grandkids someday. And I hope that you all are able to do the same. All I can tell you is that being involved in racing was not on my life plan, but it's been so much fun to see how life doesn't work out the way that you think it will, but that ultimately, whether you know it or not, it's working out exactly as it's supposed to.